One of my favourite dishes is um, taking an idea of, of a Japanese style and pairing it with a salmon. So basically I'm curing the salmon in the teriyaki cure, so it's soy sauce, mirin, sugar. Um, the salmon fillet is marinated in the teriyaki mix. The salmon fillet is then cooked very, very slowly in the oven, just to a core temperature of 40 degrees. So it's still quite opaque, still got that sort of rawish texture, but it's, it's cooked through. And then I finish it with a blowtorch to give it a sort of a toasty effect. It sort of caramelizes the soy on the top, it brings out these flavor notes of the soy sauce. Then the dish is paired with a dashi stock, which is basically a Japanese stock made with seaweed or kelp, um, which has got all those Japanese flavors and it's got this, what they call the umami, it's the fifth taste sensation. So you've got a lot of richness, a bit of moorishness going through the dish. So we jellify this stock, we set it in the bottom of the bowl and the salmon is dressed on the top. Then with that we make an oyster emulsion, or basically an oyster mayonnaise. So that's um, little points on the dish as well. So as you're eating you've got the salmon um, with the, the richness and the soy going through it, the teriyaki style. And then I pair that with some green apple, some kohlrabi and the pea shoots and the fresh peas. Lots of people and in the Western culture we would use a lemon juice or orange. So the green apple I use as an acidity base basically um, and uh, it just gives a nice fresh notes to the dish, cleanses the palate and everything marries together on the plate and it's a good, uh, it's a good appetizer.